Um, New at 11, a fight for community. People who live in a historically black neighborhood in Blue Ash say they want to keep their aging community center. The city is considering replacing it with a more modern design. Nine on your side's Kristen Swilly joins us live right now from Blue Ash to break down the controversy. Kristen? Yeah, well, Craig, no one is arguing that the Hazelwood Community Center is ideal. The real fight is whether it's worth saving or replacing with something brand new. We fought hard years ago to get a community center and to possibly see it torn down uh, for outdoor uh, shelter is just unreal. Wilma Bird has lived in Hazelwood her entire life. She knows what this 40 year old building means to the people who live here. People that don't have ways or the funds to join the recreation center here at Blue Ash, they know they have a spot in the Hazelwood area. And it's why she and others who showed up Thursday night are frustrated. The city is considering replacing it with an open air facility. We're not going to use a shelter in the winter. It's too cold. One argument against the current Oak Avenue Center is it's not often used, but supporters say that's a symptom of odd hours and a larger problem. When kids come, they have a TV. They have an old hand-me-down foosball table, and that's all they have. The $400,000 it would cost to build a new shelter is twice as expensive as renovating the current community center, but some argue the old building isn't worth investing in. It's still the same structure. It's still 2,000 square feet. While the people who live in Hazelwood would like to work with what they have. When it's gone, it's gone. They're taking away the heart and soul of the community. Now, council did not vote on the community center's future tonight. They say they plan to take it up formally at a future meeting. Reporting live in Blue Ash this evening, Kristen Swilly, 9 on your side.